Hi everyone, welcome back. Today we are going to learn the division problems. This is the symbol of division. Okay, now let's begin with the first problem. 42 divided by 2. Here 42 is the dividend and this number with which we are going to divide that is known as the divisor. Okay, the number which we are going to divide is called the dividend and the number with which we are going to divide is called the divisor. Okay, now here in order to do the division we need to know the tables. So let's start with the table of 2. Okay, now in the table of 2 first we have to see whether this digit is coming or no. Okay, so in the table of 2 whether 4 is coming or no let's see 2 1s are 2, 2 2s are 4. Okay, so 2 2s are 4. Okay, then we are going to do the subtraction. Okay, here we will get 0. Okay, now we will bring this next digit down. Okay, we will bring this digit down. So, this 2 will come here. Then again we are going to say the table of 2. 2 1s are 2. Okay, 2 1s are 2. Then again we are going to do the subtraction and then we are going to get 0 over here. 2 minus 2 is 0. So this is the remainder. The number which we get at the bottom is called the remainder. And this is the answer. This is called the quotient. This is called the quotient. Okay. 42 is the dividend. 2 is the divisor. Okay. And the answer which we get here above this is called the quotient and here the number which we get at the bottom is called remainder okay so 42 divided by 2 the answer is 21 okay now let's see the next problem 27 divided by 3 27 divided by 3 now let's see let's say the table of 3 3 ones are 3 now in the table of 3 we don't get 2 anywhere so then we'll consider both the digits Okay, this and the next digit. So, 27. In the table of 3, where we are going to get 27? We get 3 9s are 27. Okay, 3 9s are 27. Okay, then we will do the subtraction here. So, 27 minus 27 is 0. Okay. So, here the remainder is 0 and the quotient is 9. So, the answer is 9. 27 divided by 3, the answer is 9. Okay. Now, let's do the next problem. Here, 64 divided by 4. Now, let's say the table of 4. 4 1s are 4. 4 2s are 8. But here, 6 is lesser than 8. So, we will consider 4 1s are 4. Okay, 4 1s are 4. Then we will do the subtraction. What we will get? 6 minus 4 is 2. Okay. Next we are going to bring this digit down. Okay, so we will get 4 over here. So this is 24. Now in the table of 4, where we are going to get 24? 4 6 are 4 6 are 24. Okay, then again we are going to do the subtraction and we get here 0. Okay, so here 64 divided by 4, the answer is 16. That is the quotient is 16. The remainder is 0. Okay, now let's do the next problem. 95 divided by 5. Now let's say the table of 5. 5 1s are 5. 5 2s are 10. But here 9 is lesser than 10. So, we will consider the first one. 5 1s are 5. Okay. Now, let us do the minus. Here we are going to get 9 minus 5 is 4. Okay. Next, we will bring this digit down. So, here we are going to get 5, 45. Now, in the table of 5, here we are going to get 45. 5 9s are 45. 
okay then again let's do the subtraction and we are going to get here 0 okay so the answer of 95 divided by 5 the answer is 19 the quotient is 19 okay the remainder is 0 okay